A local business owner breathing a sigh of relief tonight after he says his stolen RV was recovered. Let's switch to our Liz Birch, who's following up on this from uh, the Star Day Tavern in Southeast Portland, where she just spoke with the owner. The owner of the tavern here tells me he's happy to have his RV back, but he says he's frustrated to be the latest victim of crime after it was brazenly stolen from the street outside of his home. It's parked on the street, it's locked up. Um, there's no keys available for it, but in broad daylight. These are pictures of his RV before it was stolen. Star Day Tavern owner Justin Amrine says he uses it for work. He says someone took it yesterday afternoon when it was parked outside his home. That is, it's disheartening and it's, I don't know, it just, it, it, I think the last few years, especially there's, there's been a, for me, for sure, there's been a feeling of just like, you know, looking over your shoulder all the time, not really knowing what's next, kind of a free for all sort of, uh, um, just in terms of, and it's not really, I don't want to say the wild west, but it, I mean, it, it kind of is. He tells me one of his friends spotted the colorful RV today and he was able to get it back this afternoon. He says it was damaged and filled with trash. Just like metal flakes all over the um, the floorboard of the driver's side and it's just like hollowed out and, and the, the, the actual door lock on the driver's side was just out. They just pulled the whole thing out. Um, and of course, it was filled with so much random stuff. According to data I got from police today, around a thousand cars are being stolen a month in Portland. That's insane. I can't even like try to, if you try to wrap your mind around that number, there's a lot of things happening and there's not a lot of consequences. And Ryan says he's just happy to have his beloved RV back though, and credits the tight knit neighborhood and spirit of the community for getting it to him so quickly. It's amazing how, how just, the, the people of this neighborhood are amazing, and, and I, I'm thankful for all of them. And police tell me today they don't have that recovery report just yet, so we'll keep you updated on that. The owner tells me that RV is in the shop right now where they're determining just how bad the damages are. In Southeast Portland, Liz Birch, Coin 6 News.